All right, here we go again on one of my wild uh, cells that I do. I'm trying to get that Excalibur too. I've been wanting one for a long time now. And somebody made me an offer that I can't refuse, but I might have to because I don't have any money. But I do have gold. I have lots of rings and necklaces. And today I'm going to go ahead and try to um, sell them, to be honest with you. All right, first of all, I got this 1775 Spanish coin. Um, you guys have watched my videos, have seen it. Uh, I don't know if it's from a shipwreck or what, but I won it from a guy on YouTube on the East Coast. Pretty cool coin. I forget what it's called, but it's a Spanish coin. Um, like pirate's treasure. <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs> I don't know if it actually is, but anyways, I got that. I'll try to get a better shot of it at the end. Um, let's start off with this 18 karat gold chain with a pendant on the scale it weighs 10.2 grams so I'm gonna go ahead and write that down 10.2 then got a junker gold 14 karat gold fake diamonds it weighs 2.4 2.4 grams 14k 2.4 then we got another junker 22 karat gold I call it a junker because it's so, so thin <laughs> anyways that one weighs one and a half we'll put that down as 1.5 one and a half grams then which one's the least junkiest oh these all next ones are all good 18 karat gold white gold um i've seen these online for like 700 bucks something no like 500 i don't know the cheapest one though would probably be like 500 if you can find it for that cheap i'm weighing it 6.6 .6 grams of 18k 6.6 .6. um, for some reason the white gold bands are they're very expensive here's a 14k super nice white gold with three diamonds I don't know what the carrots equal, but there's three diamonds in there. And the camera doesn't want to focus. But let's throw it on the scale again. Probably at least seven hundred dollar ring, brand new. I'm saying four point two grams of eighteen k. Four point two. Then we got last, but definitely not least. My best ring. I had tested it, and uh, the outer band is 18 karat gold. The rest of the ring, the whole ring, is 22 karat gold. So with this one, I'm going to weigh it as a total weight. But when I figure out the cost, I will try to separate them. That's five grams. See here, yeah, five grams. Well, 5.2 or 5.1, yeah, 5.2, 5.2 grams. No, 5.1, I'll say because it went down. 5.1. Now, what I'm gonna do is go on my computer here and go to. 
open a new page scrap gold and I'm going to use this gold calculator to add up everything I don't know if you guys can see that on there so you just click that type in 10 point two and then it's 18 karat gold it says it right there let me see if I show you guys a little better see it says 18k then I go down here and I hit the calculate the price of today's value and it tells me it's worth two hundred and eighty nine dollars two hundred and eighty nine dollars so I'll write that down by this one by the 10.2 because that was the 18 karat gold chain that's that one so 289 plus some pennies which I'm not going to count two eight nine and I think the prices of gold are down right now so if anybody wanted to buy the stuff that I'm selling it'd be a good time to buy it but I'm gonna go ahead and do that with the rest of them otherwise it's gonna take too long to make for me to check each one and, and then I'll, I'll come up with a total and then I'll show you guys and I'll finish the video it's just scrap gold I'm calling it even though it's really not all right I finished up and um, here's what I ended up with. The chain was 289. The 18 karat white gold ring was 187. The diamond ring with white gold 14k only 92 dollars. That's like at least this is that's a lot of money for that ring. That's like hundreds of dollars for that ring. Um, to buy it new, that would be a 138 plus 28 now what I did on this one since it's 22 karat gold most of it and then 18 karat gold you can see the white ring in the center there the there's two rings one of them's 18k I tested it and that's what it came out as so I took four grams of 22k plus one gram of 18k that's how I came up with a 138 plus 28 so that's for that ring. Then the 22 karat gold ring only came to $52 because it only weighed 1.5. And you can see it's a little bent right there. So, I mean, easy fix, really easy fix. Put that on a little sling and it'll bend right out. Um, the one with the fake diamonds, and it's only 14K, is $53 more than the 22k um, but it weighs more it's 2.4 grams then there's the gold coin a better shot of it um, the guy I got it from said it's worth two to three hundred dollars I'm selling it for 150 in this bundle um, the whole bundle comes to nine hundred and eighty nine dollars now what I'm gonna do is I only need eight hundred dollars and I don't really want to sell this stuff so I'm gonna ask nine hundred dollars or best offer for everything I'm not piecing it out and I'm only leaving this video up for two days if it doesn't sell within those two days I'm just going to keep the stuff because I don't really want to sell it. But I can't pass up the deal on the detector I can get. And that's where I'm at. I just made this decision today. I wasn't sure how I was going to do this. And the guy's waiting for me, so he's being really generous. Um, so I'm going to tell him. I haven't even told him yet. I'm going to wait two days and to let him know if I can get it or not. And then he's going to post. He's going to sell the detector. 
So that's where I'm at. And uh, hopefully you have PayPal or what I would really like is if it was somebody who lived locally or within an hour of me, um, I'll drive to you. We can meet halfway, whatever. And then you can check this stuff out and see for yourself. I mean, this 22 karat ring, I'm getting off the subject now. The, the color of it matches exactly the color of the inside of this ring. I only have one hand to show you, but uh, I'm not going to be able to. But anyways, I, I tested the stuff and I know it's real. Um, and it says it on the inside on these two. But since they're from like India or Egypt, they're from Egypt, I think. The writing like Egyptian. It's hard for me to read them. Their, their marks aren't even really clear if you could read them. But I did test them. So, um, so for that price, 900 bucks, you probably couldn't get these two rings together for 900 bucks. Okay, I'll throw in this one. These two together for 900 bucks, you could not do it. Then you'd be left with 10 carats of 18 gold and a chain. You'd have this, you'd have the gold coin, and you'd have this. All that for free, basically. You could easily get 900 for these three. If I went to eBay and sold them, I could get a lot more. I could get at least a couple of hundred for each of these. I mean, this one, that's real diamonds in there. They're not small. Look at those. Those are real diamonds. I've tested them, and I've tested a lot of diamonds since I got my tech tester. But anyways, that's it for this one.